Well, housing isn't the only controversial issue in the Mayor's intray. Here's a clue. There are calls tonight for Sadiq Khan to abandon plans for the new garden bridge. We can join our reporter Mark Ashdown, who's got more details for us. Mark. Yes, Riz, the Garden Bridge has become something of a Marmite project. Londoners, it seems, either love it or hate it. Now, the plan is for a 367-metre pedestrian crossing with Public Park right about over there. Now, it's going to cost about £175 million, £60 million of that coming from the public purse. So tonight, 100 or so members of the public gathered for a meeting to renew their opposition. And they want the new man at City Hall to look afresh at how all this was signed off. We want the new mayor to look into this uh, procurement process. We want it to be fair, open and transparent. We want him to investigate the funding behind it, the amount of public funding that's going into it. Um, we want him to realise that it's, it's not a, a great boon for Londoners. It's going to be a complete millstone around the neck. It's going to hemorrhage public funding desperately needed in places elsewhere. Now, Sadiq Khan has said he has launched an investigation into that procurement process. That will look at many things, including the role of his predecessor, Boris Johnson, in deciding the architect for all of this. Now, he's always claimed he was neutral. Uh, critics say there is evidence that the bidding process was anything but fair and open, as claimed. Now, all this will take some time. In the meantime, preparation work for all this was due to start pretty soon. It's not clear whether that can happen while the new mayor investigates. OK, Mark, thank you.